What is the scenario of paper markets after COVID? So, after COVID, the market has volatilely changed. The packaging is going superbly fine, but uh, writing printing had been bleeding. So, I feel like now it's a time the recovery is happening. And I feel like in coming months to go, paper industry will again be on a high, on a very high. Okay. Do you think? The paper industry has returned to pre-COVID level. So I totally believe that we these will be the even better levels than the pre-COVID. In recent months, the paper industry had seen severe hike in imported waste paper prices, which made the industry difficult to operate. How did you manage the plant operation in this difficult time? The price error. So. In such scarcity times, you generally have to go with the flow. But somehow, being fortunate enough, we've been through. And every the industry, though it had a huge hurdle, but everybody got through very well. Amit, the scarcity of imported fibers. One of the leading paper mills said that agro residue can be the alternate option to mitigate the fiber shortage in India. What do you think? I don't differ but I don't really fully agree with it because the fiber recovery is prime and though if there is deficiency in Indian then imported will help but the fiber recovery will be from the waste paper zone. As there is uncertainty in waste paper prices, prices may be up or down in future. What prices do you anticipate in next one year? So, as the waste market is very volatile, that will be impacting the paper industry, paper market as well, and this volatility is inevitable. Any new paper product you have launched recently? So now we are just heading in uh, packaging only, but uh, just recently we started newsprint again, and our writing printing is always like always is there. And in our packaging, we ventured into craft this time. We Our duplex is going on since very long. And couple of years back, we even started the rigid board. I'm getting a good response about that as well. That is also going very nice. Many industries say that newsprint is a dying industry. There is no future scope. How do you counter this? So, this, these are the times and the trends that comes and goes but newsprint i don't say it will completely die it will go on there are times and when there are shifts i feel like people will again shift to the normal uh, old mode of newspapers i mean hike in finished paper prices do you think the prices have achieved its peak or further increment in prices are possible I totally believe that we are going over saturation. Saturation was way behind. But the volatility is so much that right now there is no scope of saturation. Whatever the ups and downs will be, the market will go with that flow only. During COVID time, what paper production trends did you see? Such as non-traditional paper manufacturing, different product mix or many others. Do you think? So I feel like COVID has been a blessing in disguise. Blessing. Okay. It enhanced our product, uh, product baskets. Not just mine, everybody's. So earlier people, or like for me example, we were in a si single, uh, we had all our eggs in a single basket. But now they are on a multiple sides. Okay. So I believe this had helped me explore a new side of my business. And being diversified, also helps a lot. How many paper machines do you have? What is the total production per day? And varieties you manufacture? So we are making uh, writing printing paper, craft paper. Recently started newsprint. We have a duplex plant. We have a rigid board plant. And we have tissue paper, MG poster. 
What is the total production CPT per day? So about 7 800. 800 per day. Any expansion you are planning in future? We are planning, but uh, yes, like a low GSM. We are planning, but that is still on the cards. It's still some time to realize. Do you have any paper supply in food segment? We are trying to, but uh, couldn't get uh, get our hands on that.